Welcome to Hapa e Kaiwa Podcast with June Senesak, episode 275. Hey, what's going on, everyone? June here with Hapa e Kaiwa. Next month, I'm gonna be back in Japan. I'm heading back to Japan to hold my annual Hapa e Kaiwa seminars. And this time, the seminars will be hosted from March 20th through April 1st. Unfortunately, due to the limited time I can be in Japan this time, I'll only be able to hold seminars in Tokyo, Yokohama, Nagoya, and Osaka. 来月日本に戻ります。毎年恒例のハパ英会話セミナーを開催しに日本行く予定で、今回は3月20日から4月1日にセミナーが開催されます。私の日本滞在期間が限られているので、今回のセミナーは東京、横浜、名古屋と大阪のみとなります。In this seminar, I'm g o i n g to talk about the most common issues English learners struggle with and the steps you can take to overcome them. Do you have a hard time understanding native speakers and keeping up with their speed? Have you been studying English for many years and yet the words don't come out when you speak? Do you ever find yourself not sure which study method is best for you? If so, don't worry at all. That's how the majority of language learners, not just Japanese learners, face when learning a new language. In the first half of the seminar, I'm gonna talk about these common technical issues and specific things you can do to overcome them. 今回のセミナーでは、英語を学習している人たちが抱える共通の悩みとその解決法についてお話しします。皆さんはネイティブの英語が早すぎて聞き取れなかったり、理解できなかったことはありませんか英語を長年勉強しているのに、会話となると英語がとっさに出てこないことはありませんかまた自分にとってどの学習法が適切なんだろうと迷ったことはありませんか実はこれらの悩みは日本人に限らず、言語を学習しているほとんどの人たちがぶつかる壁です。セミナーの前半ではこのようなテクニカルな悩みについて一緒に考え、具体的な克服法をシェアしたいと思います。The second half of the seminar is g o i n g to focus on how to overcome the mental obstacles.I've been studying for a long time now, but I don't feel like my English is improving.I want to speak English, but I get self-conscious about my pronunciation and I worry about making mistakes. I'm busy with work and life and it's hard to consistently study English. These are some of the most common issues that language learners face and that includes myself. Of course for me, it was learning Japanese, but I was faced with the same problems when I was learning Japanese. In the second half of the seminar, I want to share with you guys how I overcame these mental obstacles through my own personal experience. セミナーの後半ではメンタルな悩みの乗り越え方についてお話しします。英語を長いこと勉強しているのに上達を実感できない。英語を話したいけど自分の発音が気になったり間違えてるんじゃないかと不安になってしまう。仕事や日々の生活で忙しくて英語はなかなか続かない。これらは私を含め言語を学習している人たちの共通の悩みでしょう。もちろん私の場合は日本語になりますが、私も日本語を勉強していた時に同じ問題に常に悩まされていました。セミナーの後半では、個人の経験を通して私がどうやってこのようなメンタルブロックを乗り越えたのかをシェアしたいと思います。It's gonna be a fun seminar, and more than anything, I'm excited to be back in Japan to see all of you guys.I'm hoping through this seminar, you'll be able to find some clues to help you achieve a breakthrough and get you to the next level. You can find more information about the Hapa e Kaiwa seminar on my blog. Looking forward to seeing you guys in Japan next month. 楽しいセミナーになると思います。そして何より、日本で皆さんと直接お会いできることを楽しみにしています。このセミナーを通じて、皆さんが何かしらのヒントを見つけ、次のレベルに達することができることを願っています。Hapa e Kaiwa のセミナーの詳細はブログに掲載していますので、興味のある方はぜひチェックしてください。来月皆さんと日本でお会いできることを楽しみにしています。Alright, l let's get into today's topic. In today's conversation, Chris and Christian talk about their thoughts on the growing popularity of veganism. Why are vegan diets on the rise? Let's listen to Chris and Christian and learn how they feel about veganism. さあ
今日の課題に入りましょう。今日の会話ではクリスとクリスチャンが高まるビーガン人気について意見交換をします。なぜビーガンダイエットは普及しているのでしょうかビーガンについて二人がどう思っているのか、彼らの会話を聞いてみましょう。Are you ready? Let's get started! Questions of the day. 今日の質問 .No.1 u m b e What about veganism does Christian dislike? クリスチャンはビーガンのどのような点を嫌っていますか ?No.2 u m b e What aspect of the food industry does Christian believe needs change? 食品業界のどのような側面について変革が必要だとクリスチャンは考えていますか Number three. What sort of product does Chris mention that is becoming more prominent in restaurants? Chris が言及したレストラン業界で存在感を強めている製品とはどのようなものですか Live conversation. What do you think of、um, people that are going completely vegan? I think it's probably、uh, very good for the environment. Um, and is very, I guess, I don't know if I'd say noble, but、uh, you know, it could be seen as that. However, I hate when they push their opinions down my throat with their vegan mm. Uh, mm. ideology. Mm-hmm. Um, you're a bad person. I know, I know. If you, you don't, if you eat meat, you're a terrible person. How dare and, you? Don't you care about the animals? Yeah, exactly. <laughs>、um, so that's just bombarded on like Instagram or Snapchat or Facebook, you know? And like, I get it, you know? Like, being, you know, t- like the food industry and like, you know, how they process all the food and all that, it's like terrible for like cows and animals and all that.、Um, that's horrible. That should definitely be changed. However, I do think humans need some, like, like they need meat. And, I agree, I agree. And there's been studies on that.、Um, however, there's a better way of doing it, so I understand that as well. What about Beyond Meat? Beyond, like, have you exactly, tried, have you tried I have、that? not tried Beyond Meat. How's Beyond Meat? I haven't tried it either. I'm, I'm a, I'm a I've heard it, it tastes、so. like, my friend, I don't know if he was joking, but he's like, yeah, it tastes like chicken. So,、uh, <laughs> so that works. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, these companies are sprouting up. They're brand, you know, these, you know, they're multi billion dollar new companies that have just opened up on like the stock exchange and stuff like that. And、uh, they,、um, you know, they have billions of dollars backing them and、uh, they're coming out with these new products and they're in McDonald's now. Burger King, you know, even,、um, you know, like, I don't know if Popeyes is doing it, but there's a few other s、uh, restaurants that are going to like the Beyond Meat product. And it's really interesting to see. I mean, I'm not sure how far it'll go, but we'll see, you know. No, I'm glad we're progressing to a future of like healthier, you know, choices.、Mm-hmm. Um, especially, you know, even, you know, if, if let's say we all went vegan, I would be fine with that.、Um, However, like, I know that's gonna take a long progress, especially people who、um, I, I know very well who are like, no, I love meat, I cannot give it up. Yeah, that's so, right.、Uh-huh. So that's gonna be very difficult for, especially like Americans who love like burgers, barbecues, and.、Uh, absolutely, absolutely. you know. Let's go over the answers. 今日の質問に答えていきましょう。Number one What about veganism does Christian dislike? クリスチャンはビーガンのどのような点を嫌っていますか He dislikes the forcefulness with which some vegans advocate their diet and lifestyle. 自分の食事やライフスタイルを主張し、押し付けてくるビーガンがいることを彼は嫌っています。Number two. What aspect of the food industry does Christian believe needs change? 食品業界のどのような側面について変革が必要だとクリスチャンは考えていますか Christian feels the food industry's poor treatment of animals, particularly in the production of meat products, needs to be changed. 食品業界における肉製品の製造において、特に動物が粗末に扱われている現状は変革が必要だとクリスチャンは感じています。No.3 u m b e What sort of product does Chris mention that is becoming more prominent in restaurants? Chris が言及したレストラン業界で存在感を強めている製品とはどのようなものですか 
Chris mentions Beyond Meat, a meat substitute product that is being sold in an increasing number of restaurants around the country. 大体肉である Beyond Meat を扱うレストランがアメリカ国内で増えていることについてクリスは言及しました。Summary 会話の要約 Chris and Christian talk about the rise of veganism and vegan diets. Christian begins by describing his thoughts on the positive and negative aspects of veganism. Chris and Christian are vegan の増加とその食事内容について話します。Christian はまず、vegan に対する自身の肯定的な考えと否定的な考えを説明します。Christian feels that vegans' diets are good for the environment. However, He dislikes how forceful some vegans are in advocating their diets and lifestyles to other people. Christian は vegan の食事は環境にいいと感じています。しかし中には自分の食事やライフスタイルを他人に押し付ける vegan がいることを彼は嫌っています。Christian does appreciate vegans' criticism of the food industry, particularly those areas involved in meat production and the poor treatment of animals. Still, he feels that humans need meat in their diets. Christian は主に食肉生産や動物の粗末な扱いに関して食品業界に向けられたビーガンの批判はよく理解しています。しかしそれでも人間の食事に肉は必要だと彼は感じています。Chris brings up the subject of Beyond Meat, a meat substitute product that is being produced by well-financed companies And being sold in an increasing number of restaurants in the United States. Christian is unopposed to a future where vegan products are more widely consumed, but believes a long transition away from meat will have to take place before that can happen. Chris は資金力のある企業によって製造され、アメリカ国内のレストランで販売を増やしている代替肉、Beyond Meat を話題に挙げます。ビーガン製品がより幅広く消費される未来についてクリスチャンに異論はありませんが、肉を食べない文化が実現するまでには長い移行時間が必要だろうと彼は考えています。Phrases of the day 今日のフレーズ n u m b e r o n e Push down someone's throat 人に無理に押し付ける Push down someone's throat は直訳すると、人に何かを無理やり飲ませるで、主に人や動物に薬を無理やり飲ませる状況で使われます。しかし日常会話では、自分の考えや意見を人に押し付けるという意味でも使われます。例えば、彼は自分の意見を人に押し付けるは、He pushes his opinions down people's throats と言います。push の代わりに、shove や force Ram を使うこともできます。例文 Sometimes he has tendencies to push his opinions down people's throats. 彼は時々自分の意見を人に押し付けがちです。I hate it when salespeople try to shove their products down our throats. 店員が無理やり商品を売りつけようとしてくるのが嫌だね。Don't force it down his throat. Let him decide on his own. 彼に無理に押し付けちゃダメだ。彼に自分で決めさせなよ。No.2 Bombard 攻める Bombard は本来ミサイルや爆弾などで敵を砲撃することを意味する単語ですが、日常会話では質問や要求、情報などが絶え間なく入ってくる様子を攻撃と比喩的に表す際にも使います。例えば、質問攻めにするは、Bombard with questions と言います。例文 I was bombarded with questions at the seminar yesterday. 昨日のセミナーで質問攻めに遭いました。I had a hectic day. I was bombarded with customer complaints all day. 今日は慌ただしい一日でした。一日中、顧客からの苦情が殺到していました。He's been bombarding me with text messages. He sent me over 50 messages yesterday. 彼からすごい数のメッセージが送られてくるんです。彼、昨日は50通以上のメッセージを送ってきました。No.3 Beyond Meat Beyond Meat Beyond Meat 
は最近アメリカで話題になっている植物由来の人工肉の開発、製造を手掛けるアメリカ企業です。エンドウ豆などを主原料とし、ハンバーガーのパテやひき肉、ソーセージ、鶏肉などを模した完全植物性の人工肉を開発しています。すでにマクドナルドやバーガーキング、TGI フライデースやハードロックカフェなどでそうした人工肉が導入されており、スーパーでも買うことができます。人工肉を開発している有名な企業は他にもあり、Impossible Foods がその一つです。例文 Have you ever tried Beyond Meat? Beyond Meat を食べたことはありますか Does a Beyond Meat burger taste like a real burger? Beyond Meat のハンバーガーは本当のハンバーガーと同じ味がするの I heard you can buy Beyond Meat at stores like Target, Costco, and Whole Foods. ビヨンドミートはターゲットやコストコ、ホールフーズといったお店で買えるらしいよ。No.4 オムニボー雑食動物英語では雑食動物をオムニボーと言います。また肉食動物はカーニボー草食動物はアーバボーと表します。日本語では人のタイプを肉食系や草食系などと表現しますが、それを英語にそのまま置き換えると不自然なので使い方には気をつけましょう。例文 I'm an omnivore. I'll eat anything. 私は雑食なので何でも食べます。Have you ever wondered why the biggest animals are herbivores? 大型動物がなぜ草食なのか疑問に思ったことはありますか I'm definitely a carnivore. I can't live without my meat. 私は間違いなく肉食です。肉なしでは生きられません。No.5 u m b e Sprout up 急に成長する。出現する。Sprout は本来植物が芽を出すことを表す単語ですが、日常会話では人やビジネスなどが成長する意味としても使われます。up を加えると急成長のニュアンスが加わり、例えば新しいレストランが続々とオープンしている様子を表す際などに使われます。例文 Shared offices have been sprouting up all over Tokyo. シェアオフィスが都内で続々と増えている。There are many cafes and restaurants sprouting up in this area. この辺りはカフェやレストランが急増しています。After I downloaded the software, Problems started sprouting up. ソフトウェアをダウンロードしたら次々と問題が発生し始めました。今日のフレーズを復習しましょう。Repeat after me. No.1 u m b e Push down someone's throat. Sometimes he has tendencies to push his opinions down people's throats. I hate it when salespeople try to shove their products down our throats. Don't force it down his throat. Let him decide on his own. Number two, bombard. I was bombarded with questions at the seminar yesterday. I had a hectic day. I was bombarded with customer complaints all day. He's been bombarding me with text messages. He sent me over 50 messages yesterday. Number three, Beyond Meat. Have you ever tried Beyond Meat? Does a Beyond Meat burger taste like a real burger? I heard you can buy Beyond Meat at stores like Target, Costco, and Whole Foods.
Number four, omnivore. I'm an omnivore. I'll eat anything. Have you ever wondered why the biggest animals are herbivores? I'm definitely a carnivore. I can't live without my meat. Number five, sprout up. Shared offices have been sprouting up all over Tokyo. There are many cafes and restaurants sprouting up in this area. After I downloaded the software, problems started sprouting up. Are you guys ready? Let's listen to the conversation one more time. Live conversation. What do you think of、um, people that are going completely vegan? I think it's probably、uh, very good for the environment. Um, and is very, I guess, I don't know if I'd say noble, but、uh, you know, it could be seen as that. However, I hate when they push their opinions down my throat with their vegan mm. Uh, mm. ideology. Mm-hmm. Um, you're a bad person. I know, I know. If you, you don't, meat, if you eat meat, you're a terrible person. How dare and, you? Don't you care about the animals? Yeah, exactly. <laughs>、um, so that's just bombarded on like Instagram or Snapchat or Facebook, you know? And like, I get it, you know? Like, being, you know, t- like the food industry and like, you know, how they process all the food and all that, it's like terrible for like cows and animals and all that.、Um, that's horrible. That should definitely be changed. However, I do think humans need some, like, like they need meat. I and, agree, I agree. And there's been studies on that.、Um, however, there's a better way of doing it. So I understand that as well. What about Beyond Meat? Beyond, like, have you, exactly, tried, have you tried I have、that? not tried Beyond Meat. How's Beyond Meat? I haven't tried it either. I'm, I'm a, I'm a I've heard it, it tastes、so. like, my friend, I don't know if he was joking, but he's like, yeah, it tastes like chicken. So,、uh, <laughs> so that works. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, these companies are sprouting up. They're brand, you know, these, you know, they're multi billion dollar new companies that have just opened up on like the stock exchange and stuff like that. And、uh, they,、um, you know, they have billions of dollars backing them and、uh, they're coming out with these new products and they're in McDonald's now. Burger King, you know, even,、um, you know, like, I don't know if Popeyes is doing it, but there's a few other、uh, restaurants that are going to like the Beyond Meat product. And it's really interesting to see. I mean, I'm not sure how far it'll go, but we'll see, you know. No, I'm glad we're progressing to a future of like healthier, you know, choices.、Mm-hmm. Um, especially, you know, even, you know, if, if let's say we all went vegan, I would be fine with that.、Um, However, like, I know that's going to take a long progress, especially people who、uh, I, I know very well who are like, no, I love meat. I cannot give it up. Yeah, that's so, right.、Uh-huh. So that's going to be very difficult for, especially like Americans who love like burgers, barbecues, and.、Uh, absolutely, absolutely. You know. Awesome job today. Veganism has definitely been on the rise recently, especially here in California. There are more and more vegan friendly restaurants opening up. And even fast food restaurants like Burger King and Domino's are offering vegan friendly meals now. California is well known for its abundance of vegan offerings. However, that's not necessarily true for other states. お疲れ様です。特にカリフォルニアでは、ここ最近ビーガンの人気が高まっています。完全ビーガンのレストランがあちこちでオープンし、今ではファストフード店のバーガーキングやドミノピザでさえビーガン料理を提供しています。カリフォルニアにはビーガン向けの料理を提供するお店が豊富にありますが、他の州はそうでもないようです。I have nothing against veganism and I think it's great that we live in a world today that provides people with a variety of options.However, I love my meats too much and I don't think I'll be able to give that up.I look forward to eating a nice steak. 
or going to a sushi bar and eating fresh sushi. If you take that away from me, I won't have anything to live for. Alright, that might be an exaggeration, but you get my point. I need my meat. Also, don't forget, guys, if you are interested in participating in the Hapa A Kaiwa seminar, make sure you check out the blog. 私はビーガンに対して何の不満もなく幅広いオプションから食べ物を選べる時代に暮らせることは素晴らしいことだと思います。しかし私はお肉が大好きでたまらないので食べるのはやめられないと思います。美味しいステーキを食べたり、お寿司屋さんで新鮮なお寿司を食べることをいつも楽しみにしています。もしそれがないと私の人生の生きがいがなくなってしまいます。これはちょっと言い過ぎかもしれませんが、私が言いたいことは分かってもらえると思います。お肉が大好きなんです。最後に、ハパ英会話のセミナーに興味のある方は、ブログのチェックをどうぞ忘れなく。Are you guys on Instagram? ハパ英会話でインスタをやっています。現在、ユーザーの皆さんには、ポッドキャストや YouTube、メルマガやブログなどを利用して英語を学習していただいてますが、今度はその学んだ英語をアウトプットできる場として、ハパ英会話のインスタを使ってみませんかハパ英会話のインスタでは実践的なミニ英会話レッスンを配信していますので、勉強の合間や仕事の休憩時間など、ちょっとした隙間時間に英語のアウトプットの場としてぜひ活用してください。You can find today's show notes on hapaeikaiwa.com slash podcast 275. The show notes include a full transcript and a detailed outline of today's episode. The premium version of this episode is also available on our website. The premium version includes a transcript and the Japanese translation of the entire episode as well as the English only audio file. Please come by our site for more information. 今日のエピソードの詳細は、hapaeikaiwa.com スラッシュ podcast275 で掲載されています。会話の全文、今日のフレーズと要約、また、ポッドキャストでは説明できなかった表現や言い回しを英語と日本語でまとめてありますので、ぜひご覧ください。また、ハパオンラインショップでは、ポッドキャストプレミアム版も販売しております。プレミアム版は、私のナレーション部分を含めた、ポッドキャストの台本が丸ごと収納された和訳付きテキストブックと、日本語すべて取り除いた英語のみの音声ファイルがセットになっています。詳細はブログでご確認ください。If you have any comments or feedbacks, feel free to leave a message on my blog. ご意見やご感想などありましたら、ハパ英会話のブログまでにぜひ投稿してください。ハパ英会話は Facebook, Twitter, Insta, YouTube でほぼ毎日会話に役立つ英語のワンポイントレッスンをお届けしています。また毎朝午前6時に無料のメルマガを配信していますので、まだ登録されていない方はぜひご登録ください。Thanks for listening today. You guys have an awesome day and I will catch you again next week. Take it easy. Peace. <音楽>